I'm back, Doc. I'm back, part three, Doc. What the hell? As we return, Dallas and Stubber made their way back to the guards' post. Yep. Duh. Go ahead and proceed to uh, Krieg's office. Krieg is looking at his stuff. Like okay. he had a data speak in his office. Okay. Panda has showed up, huh, Panda? Panda! Um. Alright. Duh. Hey, Krieg, I, I had a. An interesting uh, encounter with Overseer uh, Ranex. Uh, he's a very stubborn fellow. Ah, uh, yes, he's very dedicated to, to his job. Hmm. I uh, tried to requisition some uh, inventory records from him, and he was. Very aggressive, or responded very aggressively, um, as if I had insulted his position. Uh, yes, it may be best to let me go about requisitioning those. Hmm. Fair enough. Um, what, what were you looking for specifically? I was trying to see, uh, <clears throat> going back to the uh, the rumor I'm, I'm trying to chase, um, one of the uh, rumors, as you recall, was in regards to uh, melta canisters, um, possibly being used as part of the uh, IED. Yes. Um, I suspect, given what you've told me of your uh, security of the Mechanicus Tower, that they had to have come from the, uh, or were taken from, rather, the fabrication center. So you're just looking for, uh, any errors in the, uh, Melta count, basically? Exactly. Alright, uh, I will requisition those forms from him. I feel he would probably comply more if this went through proper channels. He is a very orderly kind of person. Hmm. Um, as well as, uh, any, anything that you, I, I actually believe perhaps a, in addition to that would be, uh, any kind of reports that reflect any kind of loss, um, given the nature of the explosive device, I, I do believe that they had to have originated somewhere here in, um, Omicron. 71DX. Um, beta decks, they're the most advanced thing they have in that town is a bar. And places like Loch Nitt, from what I've heard, sound just like tribal villages. So it, it seems, aside from the spaceport, they would have had to originate it from here or there. Yes, it's it. Those are the two most logical locations. Yes. So, <clears throat> I think at the very least, the the melted canister is one thing, as well as the uh, uh, a short range detonator would be the other thing to look for. <clears throat> uh, very well. I will ask him for a a full inventory of the last month, and I will have my people mull over it for anything that meets your description. Mm. Excellent. Um, I know it's been only a, a short couple of hours, but have we any any people that have come forward in in hopes of earning the reward? Uh. No, none yet. Uh, a few people have said that they knew something, but uh, upon interrogation, they appeared to be lying and they were dealt with properly. Oh. You're using interrogation techniques. Most excellent. 
Um, I, I think perhaps um, one way to further this would be perhaps to uh, add to the uh, the bounty walls that also showcase the uh, Carnosaur reward and perhaps maybe even you could take it one step further and uh, put it in writing in the uh, living quarters of the laborers very well I will send someone to do that very well um Let's see, it's like, what, 8.30 or something? Um, it's like 9.40-ish. Like 9.40, Um. <clears throat> oh, fuck it, why not? Um, Krieg, uh, I hate to bother you with more, but given the uh, the time of night... I was hoping you could perhaps put my party up here at the uh, the barracks for the night. Uh, if you wish, you may stay here for the night. Mm. Most excellent. Um, could you have a, a, a guardsman escort us to uh, where we may slumber tonight? Uh, he types on the data sheet and a, a servitor walks in. Uh, I will have this servitor escort you to your cots. Ah, that works as well. May the uh, God Emperor uh, watch us as we sleep. Yes, the Emperor protects. Yeah, go ahead. Salute him and walk out. Okay. And uh, Ben, unless you have anything you want to do, I plan on sleeping. <clears throat> Anything? Nope. Okay. So yeah, the servitor shows you to a uh, very uh, regimented room. Uh, you're sharing it with quite a few other uh, tech priests and uh, guards, basically. Mm. They show you to your your three cots, and, uh, yeah. You decide if you want to go to bed or not. Yeah, I proceed to sleep. Alright. I'll assume Tibble did the same. Yep. Ben? Mmm... Yeah. Come on, you, you, could, you could be useful for something. I roll for initiative? Uh, at... Midnight, you are awakened by your Vox screeching and Leaf yelling over the Vox caster that there was an attack on uh, Beta Dex. There was a massive explosion at the church. Mm. And they're currently trying to put out the fire. A uh, uh, Leith, a, an explosion, you say. Um, was any of our, our party members injured? She unmutes her mic. No. <laughs> Mr. <Mister>, please. <laughs> People are dying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they're poor people and their farmhands. People are dying. And their other clerics. It's a church that exploded. Yeah. I don't really well, care about more of them. This is my mission. Yeah, you're like the worst cleric. <laughs> let's, go, oh. let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hey, hey, the god emperor will take care of them. <laughs> That's true, he will. He will. The emperor protects. I have no reason to doubt that any of them are in truly danger. Well, I might, they might be dead, but it'll protect their soul. Yep. That's what that means. Yep. Yep. Anyways. Um. Hmm. All right. What is the approximate walking distance? Like, how long would it take us to walk there? Three hours, maybe. 
<laughs> Drive? 30 minutes. Uh, slightly better. Okay, then. Um... Probably be a two hour walk, 30 minute drive. Is the barracks under alert of any kind? Um, there are people moving about in kind of a hurried fashion, but since you're in the, uh, just, like, the sleeping quarters, it's not like there's a massive amount of commotion going on in there. Uh -huh. But you can the hear people, like, out in the actual guard post, scurrying about. Okay. Um, then I, I guess I'll, uh, go to where I hear people scurrying. Oh, actually, wait. Before I leave the room... I'm gonna wake up Tibble. Okay. And then I'll walk out of the room. Alright. And, um, again, I'll go towards where I hear the sounds, um, to see what these people are doing. Uh, yeah, you see a bunch of servo, servo skulls and tech priests, uh, exchanging data and other stuff. Most of them are being spoken very quickly in, uh, binary cant, and you can't make out most of it. Or you can't make out any of that. Okay. I'm glad I brought Tibble. Tibble, what what are they what are they talking about? Are they talking about Star Wars? I guess God, so. I wish. <laughs> oh, Tibble, please. <laughs> Negative six. I can't tell. They're all talking so fast. It's very jumbled. <sighs> Tibble, you have total recall. Why you do this? He can perfectly remember the jumbled. Good. Um. If you gave him time to mentally decrypt all this, he might be able to figure out what they're saying. Uh. All right, fine. Then I guess I'll I'll approach one of the tech priests. Uh, tech priest, I I need to get to beta decks. Do you know where I could uh, acquire a car? He he looks at you and then points over to uh. Uh, why do I Creek's office His office is this close to the Okay Um fine I'll go up to Creek's office Well he Duh. just points you in the general direction And maybe he says Creek's office Mark okay. with Creek Fine I'll burst into Creek's office Good I'm sure he'll appreciate that again Yep You see Creek Behind his desk, with a bunch of service goals, a lot of service goals, dropping off data sheets, and he's rapidly filling them out, and they are flying away from him. So he's very frantic? Well, huh. he's, he's, he looks very in control. There's just a lot of stuff going on. Oh, okay. Like he's just like, bam, da 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 bam, bam, da 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 bam, bam, da 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 like, Okay. He seems calm. There's just a lot of shit he's doing. Okay. Fair enough. Um, uh, Krieg, Krieg, I... I... I need to get to beta decks. There, there was a, an explosion at the the, the church. Yes, yes, I've uh, I've heard. And he he takes a data sheet from behind him and uh, fills something out and then hands it to you. Uh, give this to the, the man working the bridge, and he will have a car for you. Ah, excellent. I I, I need to make sure that, uh, nobody gets to Nihilus in his weakened condition. Ah, yes, uh, of course. We must protect him. Yes. As well as the, uh, my, my brothers, the, the, the clerics. Uh, uh, thank you, cleric. I'll, I'll be on my way. Uh, I'll let you know if I, if this is related to anything at the forge. Uh, then I'll yeah. just he, run out of the he's room. He's just dealing with shit. He doesn't, yeah, I'm he's sure not really he is. paying attention. Yep. The. Alright, so then you go to the bridge. Yep. Right. Ben, you, you didn't get out of bed, by the way. Nope. Mm -hmm. Ben, you gonna get out of bed? I'll get out of the bed. Okay. And then I'll walk fine. over to the beta I'll, decks. I'll, I'll vox. You're gonna walk to beta decks. I'll vox Dallas and go. I'll be there three hours later. Dallas. I'll vox Dallas. Dallas, I. There's, there's commotion in beta decks. I, I'm. Walking over towards the bridge and have requisitioned a car from uh, Craig. Meet me there. I'm on my way. Requisition me a beat. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, you guys get in the car and uh, travel to Beta Decks. Server oh. is driving. Good. Dress these assholes. 
At about 1 in the morning, you guys see the flaming steeple of the church. Hmm. Uh, it appears that the fire has been mostly put out. Uh, and But there's still a few people working on getting the uh, the steeple and the rest of the, the church under, co- under control. Okay. Um... When we approach the uh, the church, can we make a, a point of origin, like uh, where this originated? It originated at the church. I mean, like what part of the church? You couldn't tell from outside. Okay. Fair enough. Um, I'd also like to do. Um. Perception check to see if I can see any Herontis. Actually, I should probably rephrase that. It doesn't appear to be or to have started externally, so you weren't able to tell from the outside. Thank you for making that confusing. No problem. Um, hmm. I'd like to do a perception check to see if I can see any um, Herontis nearby. Go for it. Well then. Uh, what did you roll? 95. That's it impressive. It is apparently way too dark. Can I do a perception check too, even though you it's You can do a perception check. You can't. Uh, the only thing you can do is give plus 10 to someone doing it. Like, if you're like, we're both going to do it, and then you get a, a plus 10 to it. Oh, well then can I re-roll that? No, I'll give you the plus 10. You rolled an 85. <laughs> Congratulations. Damn it. Um... As you drive by, or drive towards the town, you do notice that there are a few uh, Herontis, some helping, some milling about in the street. There's obviously not a lot, as this is beta decks. There's not a large presence there, but there's like probably five or six that you can see. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um... <clears throat> See, I guess uh, as we get closer to the church, um, Alvox Leith, uh, Leith, is uh, everyone else all right? Uh, you hear very stuttered, a very stuttered response. A few people under attack in. And that's it. And then it cuts off. Hmm. Okay. Well then, I guess I was too nosy. Um. All right then. I guess I would like. Uh, I'll go ahead and have um. Or actually, a, a tibble. Did you hear that? It, it sounded like. There's something going on at the end as well. Um, c- can you can you communicate with the servitor and tell him to go to the the Burns Inn? Uh, he. Oh, I guess I should roll it. Not no, it... Richard. No. Let's check out. He... Oh, well, I'll just give that to you. He passed. Uh, yeah. He chats to the. Uh binary cans to the servitor and the servitor changes direction very slightly but obviously heading down the road instead of to the church mm. uh, within uh, two minutes you are outside of the burns in okay. and then uh, we would like to make an awareness check since now apparently there's danger um, I see anything that looks bad uh, from outside the thing that catches your eye the most in so far as danger is that there is a burning church down the road. Ugh. Do you like this bitch? Lied to me. Okay, then I would like to frantically... No, I'm gonna go ahead and sprint my ass up the staircase and check on my party members. Ah. This is gonna be fun. It'll be fun. What did I win behind door number one? Oh, God, Richard. <laughs> I hate you so much right now. 
It's your undamaged one. Draw shape, black shape. Oh Can no. Someone measure that and tell me if it's 60. Measure. That. Oh. Uh. I can't. But 98. Can you go down to 60? Like, tell me where 60 is. I, um, there, I think. I can't see it. It's really tiny. Yeah. Uh, damn it. Can't zoom in on my arrow. That's 63. That's fine. It's close enough. Uh, I'd be like, yeah, whatever. And then uh, going the other way. Oops, that is the wrong magnification. Is that like 30? 34? I can't see that. I think that's like 34. <laughs> that's fine. Um, Alright, so the green is the staircase that you came up. Ignore the black on the other side of the green. And the black there is the... Let's see. That's 54... Oh my god, I didn't want green again. I didn't mean it green, I'm sorry. And that's 60. Ish. Yeah, that one is 24 by 54. Okay. What is that? Uh, Shit got real. Monsters. Monsters. Ben, you really want to hope that those aren't monsters? Those are doors. I know. But if they're monsters, I'm going to throw you in first. <laughs> going to lie. Or you're going to throw you in first. Who's going in first? <sighs> Damn it, Richard. This is why I specifically tried to not say I was going to go to sleep when I was trying to get to Craig's office and the off chance you tried to fuck me while I was sleeping. <laughs> and I knew you were going to do something. You're so happy right now, though. No. I was trying to avoid this. You're like, explicitly so <laughs> trying to avoid this. You are so super happy right now. I know how you think, and I knew it was coming. It's a box. Oh. It's another box. It's just so but I can that's... mark their rooms. Oh. They're not okay. this isn't them, this is just so you know which rooms are whose. Right. Why does they get a bigger room than mine? Because you're the new person? Fuck you. I don't know which room mine yet. <laughs> give them the small oh. one. No. I give was them the pretty small big. One. Like Oh, I guess that one would be mine. Alright, give yep. them this one. <laughs> that's the that's for the staircase. Oh. Like that's the storage and storage well, thing. Fine, cut his room in half. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you really as long as you have that room? Then you're the new person. Fuck you. I feel like I'm missing somebody. I can't. Know. I don't remember who. Um. Frawl's, Frawl's not. Oh, it's because Frawl's not with us. That's why. Yeah. Nope. You're good. Yeah. Okay. We're good. Then there we go. So now you guys know which rooms are which. You guys are here. And here. Actually, I'm just going to put you guys like right, right up in the corner. Okay. This area, zoom in a bit. And combat screen. Yeah. Wing, 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 wing. Then you get to fight stuff. Yay. Yay. Alright, what do you guys want to do? Um. <clears throat> Keep in mind, until combat goes, you don't have to move in rounds. You can just tell me you want to move through the door. Oh, fine. Then I'm going, like, straight here into Nihilus' room. Well, then. Uh, you made it right out the door. Ben, what are you going to do? I'm just going to hang out in the hallway. Okay. You both and you're useless. Out. You both walk out the door and uh, are immediately fired upon. Oh, no. Oh, that's cool. I would like to make my awareness check. 
I don't think you oh get God. to make it okay. retroactively, but okay. And you fail. That's good. Good. There's three of them. All right, roll initiative. Yay. Um, why can't I select myself? I think those aren't regular movement icons. Fuck, I put, them, I put it on the map uh, layer. I have to change the layer they're on. Okay. Hold on, gotta delete these all. Except for <laughs> those, because those can stay, because we're not using them. Yep. Uh, Bella's quickie. So no, my so health bar. Quickie. Enemy. <coughs> this door. This door. We're doing that. We're doing that. That's gonna be what. That's 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 what's up. That's what's up. Good. I want to shoot Roger. All right, I'll roll your initiative for you because apparently you don't want to, Ben. No, I can do it. Wait, why can't I click my guy? Because you have to. You have to not be on the, the bar. Select move. Yeah, oh right. On the actual. Yeah. I was on the wrong one. Yep, you're on the ruler still. So. I like my ruler. Fourteen. Woo. Oh, ten. I got a ten on that. Yeah. That's weird. Well, since you were both surprised, they get a free round. Good. This will teach you to roll awareness always before going through doors. Because <laughs> I could have been a dick and been like, yeah, they put a grenade on the door. That would have been the best. I would have been so happy. Hold on, i got to find this guy. Why are you doing that? Since apparently there's no fog of war, can I make out what kind of people these are? These are uh, people wearing very, uh, very rugged leather clothing. Uh, they appear to be a bit poor. Some of them have. <coughs> uh, actually, roll perception for me. Yeah, they appear to be, you know, poor with uh, kind of leathery clothing. Uh, can I take advantage of Ben since he's next to me? Uh, mm. Actually, Ben, do you have a higher perception? What's yours at? Mine's at 34. Uh, I'll let one of you roll it as a free action. Or if both of you want to roll it, it's a half action. A perception's at, at 30. Uh, at the start of my turn. Yeah. Okay, then I guess I don't get to learn that then. Yeah, my perception is at 30. Mm. Well, that's if you want to both combine it. If you just want to oh. do you, it's free. Alright, then I'll just do me. Um. Yes, from their outward appearance, you can see some tribal tattoos uh, on there on their necks and backs. Uh, you don't really know what the symbolism means, but they, they appear to be from the dregs of society. But they are indeed human. Okay. Yes, they are humans. Damn. Gotta hope they're mutants, right? Well, you do, yeah. <laughs> Although, actually, I don't know if... I don't think hatred counteracts fear, so that might be bad. Huh? Well, because a lot of mutants instill fear when you see them. Well, it's plus 10 to anything related to that target. Well, that's your hatred, yeah. But I just mean, like, in general, seeing a mutant isn't very fun for you. Hmm, I suppose. God damn it, why can't I find what I'm looking for? Hold on. Perhaps it doesn't exist, Richard. Dun, oh, dun, exists. dun. <laughs> Richard's up a completely... There you go, I found it. Hypothetical situation, that's... You didn't even reason. make a noise. I only got like 20 minutes. Oh. Ready? Yep. Yes. Alright, so the dude in the back left is the guy who gets to go first. Hi. Uh, he pulls out a 
uh, a small uh, automatic pistol and takes an aim shot at Stubber. Or no, he doesn't yeah. take an aim shot. He just shoots off the hip. Okay. And he misses. Really? 37? Wow. Um, huh. who's this guy? So, the dude just to not, his right. He might not be prepared for weapon use. Or he might not even have the training for it. That guy shoots and hits. He hits you. He's aiming at me? Yeah. Yeah, I would like to dodge. Go for it. Ooh, wait. Do I even get to dodge since we're surprised? Surprised? No, now you get to make your awareness check. Wait. I actually don't know that. Do I? Surprise. I think you're allowed to make an awareness check, and if you pass, you're allowed to dodge. Doesn't specify. Step one surprise. Uh, it's no, 187. It's not going oh, to well. from that. It's, there's an actual thing called surprise. Let me find it. Yeah, 187. No. Because I think it would consider you to be an unaware target, which gives them a plus 30. Oh, he's already got a plus... Well, he already rolled a 6, so... Yeah, he already hit... Well, I, I don't mean, but think the other guy matters. would have hit you, because a plus 30 is insane. Uh, let's just go with you have to roll. If we'll retcon this if need be, but you have to roll an awareness. If you pass it, you can dodge. Hmm. Well, let's see. The attacking a surprised opponent plus thirty. Yeah. So that first one actually does hit them. Yeah. <coughs> so do you want to dodge the first one? Um. Because they both hit you. Um. Or you can just not take an awareness test, let the first guy hit you, and then be like, I know that second dude's there because the first dude shot me. Pew, pew. Oh. Well, then fine. We'll try to dodge the first one. Okay. Nope. Oh, good. You want to point it? Um. An auto pistol. I'll take that. All right. Let's do it. Well, you're getting hit by two of them, you know. I know, but the second one needs to be re-rolled then, since we have to change the f the first one. Why would it need to be re-rolled? They just both get a plus 30. Why would the second one get a plus 30, though? Now I know that there are people in here shooting. Okay, well then he doesn't, and he still hits you because he got a 6. Okay. So, five damage from the first guy. Okay, entirely tank that. Yep. And eleven from the second. So, I take four wounds. From the second guy? Yeah. Four armor, Okay. three toughness. Yeah, I was just looking Four wounds. Pretty good. Okay, and then the last guy, the guy that's closest to you, is going to... I guess he's going to fire at you, too, because you walked through the door first. Good. So, let me range this real quick. You are 30 meters. Okay. So he doesn't get a short range bonus. And he misses. He fires wide and hits the door behind you. Good. It is now Dallas' turn. Mmm, see, I have a weapon. You were Ow. supposed to declare that. Declare what weapon? Declare your weapon. What weapon are you using? Hunting rifle. Do you have quick draw? Uh, no. You have a half action left. Half action. What can I do with my half action? Move? You can move. Move. Shoot. Move. I'm gonna move. If I shoot here, we'll hit Roger. No. Now shoot that guy. Okay, go for it. Roll it up. Do, 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 do. R. 
Modifier, zero. Nice, you hit him. Cool. And apparently yours does it right, because you get eight damage. Eight plus two, right? Or no? Uh, 1d10 plus two. Is it 1d10 plus two? E no, wait, no, that's my chain sword. It's 1d10. And, but what's the bonus? I'm pretty sure Hunting Rifle has a bonus. Bonus. It's a, I don't think it would. It's a Hunting Rifle. Um, and it's primitive, I think. Yeah, no. Hunting Rifle, 1d10 plus 3. Really? 3, yeah. <laughs> no pen, though, because it's a solid projectile. Mm-hmm. So... I'm gonna have you roll damage separately from here on out, but you did 11 damage on that. Okay. So against the first guy... Oh, oops, the wrong button still. That was... Okay, now it's this motherfucker's turn. Oh, actually, uh, Stubber, if you want to go first, because you're the player character, so you have the option of initiative. Uh-huh. Um... Trying to figure out movement stuff again. Um... Because running is a full action, right? Yes. There's half action move. Full action move, charge, and run. And charge, run, and full action are all full action. Well, charging means I get to attack, though, right? Yes, at the end of the charge, you can attack. Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I can only charge for nine, though. <laughs> Not gonna make it. You can charge three squares. Good. This is a long ass hallway. Yeah, because it's got to be able to fit a bunch of people's rooms. <laughs> it is an end hallway. Um... I don't suppose you're going to let me use Garvel in this part, are you? This is my room, so that doesn't help me. And Tybalt is probably pissing himself somewhere down here. Uh, Leith is aware there are people here. Hmm. And this guy's crippled. Well, not crippled. Bedridden. He is technically a cripple. He lost his arm. Oh, uh, yeah, that's... that's Handicapped? Yeah. Handicapped. Physically disabled. Anyways, make a choice. Or I'll start, um, instilling, or I'll start enforcing my rule for fast combat. Well, it's not like I can do really dick from here. I mean, sprint up and do nothing. Good. Doesn't do me any good. Sprint up and be like, ooga booga booga booga. As a free action, I'll let you say ooga booga booga. <laughs> it's a free action. Oh, Richard, how generous of <laughs> you to let me do that. <laughs> Fine, I'm going to uh, full action run into this room. Through the door. Line. I have to open the door? Yeah. What? Just burst through the door. Just you go can, you just slam through the door. Just shoulder the door open. Okay, sure. Let's do that. I mean, you're, you're like in some kind of armor, right? Guard flak, yes. The door, like, basically the back four doors are open. These doors were all closed. And they are still closed. Okay. So you're gonna run through? No. Point to me where you're going. Uh, bam? I don't see your arrow. There we go. Okay. There you go. Okay, cool. <coughs> Alright. And this guy in the back is, uh, he's gonna take a shot at, at Dallas right there. Yes, he is. Yep. And he hit. 
Joy. That's just gonna take the hit? No. You should roll your dodge. You should roll your dodge. Where's my dodge button? Dodge. Base skills on the left. What? Zero. What's that mean? You rolled, he a, rolled 50. a fifty. Fifty-one. He just made it. He needed a fifty-one, and he got a fifty-one. Nice. What I've never, dodge? I have never seen that happen. Plus Congratulations. Alright, good for you. Um, so let's get that stubber. This guy is also going to shoot at Dennis. And he misses wildly. And this dude up in front is going to take a uh, burst, a semi-automatic shot at Dallas. And that's, is it a plus 10 or a plus 20 for a semi-auto? I can't remember. No idea. I'm trying to look it up. Um... Full auto, semi auto, plus 10. So he missed. Mm. And now it's Dallas' turn. Yay! So mm. I think it hit, right? No. Mm -mm. Right. I'm going to shoot this guy again. <laughs> Honey rifle, D ten, D one, D ten. Ah, uh, nice. Yes. Okay. Then oh, then you're not Stubber, keeping you can, track you can. of your ammo. Nah, he's fired so, two rounds. I know. I fired two rounds. Um. <coughs> So right now I have three bullets in my club. Right, well I don't have clubs. It's just like bullets you put in. Okay. Well let's see. It's um a hunting rifle and it has a clip. But the bullets are individual. Well, it has a magazine. Why don't okay. the bullets be individual? Because you can buy them one at a time. Yes, and then you load them in a mag. That's how it works in real life. No. You don't buy mags. Well you buy mags separately and then you put the bullets in. Well, you could buy mags, but then I feel like that's a gimmick. You're probably losing money. Oh, yeah. I mean, like, <laughs> the way normal people do it, they buy the mag separately, and then they buy the bullet. Yep. Anyway. Nice. Um. Okay. What kind of action would it be if I decided to try to box somebody? Like, is it a half action? It depends on how much you're trying to say. Oh. If it's short, then it's a free action. If it takes any... If it's more than, like, two sentences, then it's going to take, like, a half action. Okay. Um, fine. Then I guess I'll... I'm going to box... Well, I'll do a party-wide box. Um, Garvel and Leith, uh, it's... It's me, Stubber. I'm, I'm on the second floor here as well. Wake up, we have intruders. I'll give that to you as a free action. Nothing oh. comes back over the box. Yeah, I'm sure you, you were going to do that to me. Yeah, I'm good. That's why it was worth asking. Um, well then. Um, God, why does that have to be a small town with no PDF? Um... In case you guys feel like run away, that's the entrance to the staircase and the exit to this fight. You feel like backing out? Hmm. But Roger, all our people are in here. Also, then, they suck at shooting. Then they're not important to you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. Well, to Delis's knowledge, Neilis is in here. That's true. 
Um, God, I'm at six wounds. I love character sheets. Keep able to check that shit. Um, if I occupy this square, um, you'll mm? be in cover from the left. Okay. No. Say again. You'll be in cover from the left mm -hmm. too. Is that puerta? They'll have to shoot the right side of your body. What if I close the door? Then you're completely in cover. Oh. Is that a half action? You can't take up the door's area, but you can do that. Mm. Like so you, you mean I I couldn't like sit behind I like on this side of the door and shut the shut the damn thing? You could, but then you'd just be staring at a door. Hmm. Like you can't phase through the door. No why not? In Call of Duty, Roger. <laughs> um. God damn it. Hmm. Roger, make a move. I'm thinking. God damn it. I hate right. your hallways. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start taking away half actions if you keep thinking for too much longer. <laughs> Sorry, I was injured by a carnosaur earlier. <laughs> then ah, that was good. What are you blaming me for? <laughs> <laughs> Running away. Mostly. Um. God damn it! I really wish I could run further. Uh, they can only shoot the right side of my body. Fine. I'm going to occupy this space. So, half action move. Okay. Um, where's my ballistics at? Uh, 39. That's not terrible. Which one of these guys has been injured? This one? Yeah. Yeah, the front guy. Yeah. I'm going to use a half action fire at that guy. Okay. Um, and you mean you're just going to shoot at him? Yep. Okay. So. Let's see, last gun, so that's a short bonus, so that's with a red dot plus 20. Is that the gun, that could you your, did you just have nothing out and you just put your last gun out? Yeah. Okay. I haven't declared my weapon yet. Nope. Are you going to be kidding me? Really? Roll to 74. Nope. Uh. Alright, so the dude in the back is going to. Let's see. Do I have like a taunt ability? Oh. No, that's not a thing. Because uh. I'm not a retard. Okay. So this dude's gonna leapfrog and knock the door open, but not actually enter the room. But he's standing in the doorway. Good. Right there. That's gonna bring us to the dude in the back, y'all. And he is going to fire at Zestubber. Good. And he's going to hit Zestubber. God damn it. And of course, when we roll this. And of course. Damn, you roll 20. Oh, good. Alright, he does 8 damage. 8 damage? Oh, wait, no. Yeah, he does 8 what? damage. So it's 5. 5 plus 3. He... Where is he getting I the 3? I just rolled the d10 instead of adding it. I just wanted to click d10. But his gun does plus 3. You can check the last time I used the gun. What? What kind of gun is he using that's giving him a plus 3? The stub automatic. 1d10 plus 3. Impact. It doesn't matter what I say. Oh, whatever. Goes. I took only one point of damage. Okay. Quit your fucking bitching, Roger. So you're done bitch all minutes. day if I could survive longer. Leave me alone. Alright. And then this motherfucker right in front of you. He runs. 
here and slams the door behind him. You dick! <laughs> In Carvel's room? Yeah. Okay. Alright, Dallas, it's your turn. Uh... Twenty-one. Running takes up a whole action, right? Yes. Everything except for your half-action move, as far as movement, takes up a full action. Ben, you let me worry about that as well. He's close. Okay. Well, let me move over here. See, I've got three bullets left in my gun. And then I'm going to shoot at that guy. Okay. Boomp. Boomp. So you're going to move? Yeah, move. Okay. Three. It's a walk. Five. Half action. Well, you don't get... Yeah, you're just shooting. You don't get to aim. Just shoot. Because so, aiming, aiming just gives you a bonus, right? Yeah. yeah. A well, modifier. For you, it gives you two bonuses because you have an accurate weapon. Okay. So, like, a normal aiming for you gives you... Like, a half action is a plus 20 for you. Instead uh... Of you. you missed. Well, you missed. wait. He didn't put in his modifier. He didn't no, I, didn't, I wasn't aiming. He moved. So I he was moved. just shooting. Yeah, but his gun is already... It's accurate, so it gets a plus 10 for just being accurate. It gets a plus 10 if you're aiming, and it's accurate. Oh, really? It says you have to aim down sights. Oh. For you to get that modifier. Sorry, Ben. Oh, well. I already knew that. Okay, so this dude's gonna shoot at the... St oh, no, Wait, Stubbsy goes first. It's my turn. Yeah. I need to... I wonder if I do this, if it'll actually keep. Let's try that. Um... Uh, I'm putting no wait. Dropping a weapon is free action. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, then I'm going. Uh, wait, this was the one that was right here injured, right? Yes. Okay. Um, fine. I'm gonna drop my last gun, pull out my great weapon, and then um charge, charge. at this guy. <laughs> uh, if you charge, you're going to hit the door. He closed it behind him. Yeah. He said he ran through and slammed the door shut. Uh, hit the door, but yes. I'm not going to be like inside the room with him and can't attack. It won't count because you have to be able to run the last four meters, and because he closed the door, you can't do that. Because you'll have to stop at the door. So <laughs> you can't charge through it. Uh, does opening a door take up an action? It, it, it can, yeah. Well, it doesn't take up an action, but it does prevent you from running the whole way through. Uh -huh. It's huh. basically what? a free action. Then how come I was allowed to run into the room from here? Because that door was already were... open. No, was it wasn't. It? Oh, but he wasn't trying to through charge it. through it. He just he slammed through it, and that was the end of his turn. So then what's the difference through? of me charging through this door? Because you're going to slam through it, stop, and then your charge is technically over at that point. Because you have to be able to run for the last four meters of the attack for it to count as a charge. <sighs> Look, you can't charge this. Okay. Would it make that more difficult? I know. <coughs> it's my job. Fine. Redact everything I said. Okay. Shoot this fucker. Okay. Um, half action aim and fire. Go for it. So that's a... Plus 20. Plus... He's in close range, isn't he? I have a 100 meter weapon, yeah. so that's a plus 30. Why is it a plus 30? Red dot, aiming. Oh, red dot, yeah, okay, plus 30. Close combat. I, was just, I wasn't counting the red dot, because I wasn't aware of it. <coughs> Good. And... Um... He's going to attempt to dodge. Which fails colossally. Good. Is your energy damage correct? Uh. So three. That's what I'm trying to figure out. So 
I rolled a seven plus a. Th yeah, that looks right. One d ten plus three for you. Pretty okay. sure. Let me double check. Weapon. Um, ranged weapon. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Very good. All right. Uh, this enemy is going to shoot at you, Stubsy. Good. And miss colossally. Hit the door. Good. Very uh, good. This guy is going to take a uh, half action to step into the room. He's still looking out the door, but he's just in slightly better cover. And uh, he's going to shoot at Stubsy as well, but without aiming. Huh? How is he able to shoot? Okay. He doesn't shoot. He just then I guess he's going to step all the way in and be here. Okay. He doesn't shoot. So disregard that last one. Good. Just going to say apparently they can shoot through walls now. <laughs> okay. Okay, move there. Not that you could tell cuz he's not in sight of you. Deli, your turn. Uh, I guess I'll just aim and shoot this guy. Okay. With your last bullet. Can only hit part I of have... his body, by the way. Yeah? Yeah, you have to be able to hit the left side of his body. <coughs> his right, your left, yeah. Well, I have two bullets. I thought I only fired three times. Oh, yeah. Wait. Do you have five bullets in it? Yeah, yes. it's Okay, five. then you have two left. I have two <coughs> left. Alright, so I'm just gonna aim and shoot this guy, even if I can only see the left part of his right part of his body. Right, so his right. Right, his right. That's yeah, right. I said left first, but I'm right. 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 Fire the missiles. So you get close range, accurate, and aiming. So that's plus thirty. If you want to roll it at some point. Oh, alright. Um, and then... Weapon. Dang. You, you, you What's the modifier? Afterwards. Plus 30. Plus 30. Uh, uh come that, on. You landed it. But it only uh, says... For like, his body, I think. Uh, ben, roll a d2. On a 1, you hit. On a 2, you miss. One, one, D, two. Ah! That didn't matter. Miss. You missed anyways. And please. Alright, Stubbsy, your turn. Um. Hmm. Would I be able to occupy this space and open the door? Yeah, you're outside, but yeah, you can be there. Or there, yeah. Hmm. And for the charge, the last... No, I can only charge... To... No, no, that would work. Okay, fine. I'm going to occupy this space. Okay. So that's, um... Nine meters. Um... Trying to figure out if that was a full turn. What's your agility? Three, six, nine, eighteen. So that was. A, so you couldn't do that. I charged at the door. You have to attack when you're charging. You can't. Oh. Just do that. Uh. Yeah, he can shoot me if I'm here. He can shoot you if you're there too. You're here. Against, you're you're against the wall. There's no cover for that. Well, fine. I'll move here. So in front of the door, okay. and then is it a half action to open it? That's a free action to open the door. Oh, that's a free action? Okay, then. I'm going to shoot at this asshole, then. Go him! Let's plan. Go for it. So, plus 20. You don't get the red dot unless you're aiming. Uh. It's plus 10. Okay. <sighs> Okay, I guess he passed. Oh, I rolled ballistics. 
Okay. You were shooting. That's You're shooting. That is ballistics. Okay. I know. I meant to roll the other thing, but oh, okay. the gun. That's fine. Yeah. You passed. Um, so that's good. Just roll for damage. I'm working on it, then. Damn it. Enough. Go faster. Three. God, really? That that was a really shitty roll. So you like, you just kind of nicked him a little bit, and he's he's a little peeved at you. <laughs> good. He's slightly upset. I mean, his 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 arms kind of tweaking out, but you know, overall, he's, he's alright. Ow! Stop it! All right, so this dude it? is going to shoot at Stubber with a half action aim. The guy in front of me? No, the dude at the to your doorway. Left, the doorway. Can he see all of Stubber? Yeah, Stubber's standing outside of the doorway. Uh, that's weird. To me. Yeah, I agree. That is weird. Why? Nah, it's just how the hexagons are set up that's just kind of... Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. Well, but when I was in this space, these guys couldn't see me. They could see you, but they would be shooting at only your left side. Or only your right side. And what about this guy, then? So I feel like he'd only be able to see part of my... Oh, whatever. Go ahead. If you're, okay. If you're standing in that doorway and someone is standing in front of the other doorway, you can shoot all of him. Okay. I'm just looking at the boundaries you drew. <clears throat> Believe me, this makes way more sense when it's like an actual board than it does with the people. Like, than it does with just squares and hexagons. It's so confusing with just squares and hexagons. It should be just entirely squares instead of hexagons. Yeah. Make this a lot less debatable. There isn't a debate. I'm the GM when I say it goes. So, he fucking nailed that. Really? Super nailed that. You were lucky you didn't get a one, because then I would just dictate what happened to you. <laughs> <laughs> Your gun blows up, and your face blows off, and your he shot brains so blow well, up. It shattered your ankle, ricocheted off the floor, and slammed into Dallas's head. <laughs> Richard, please. Oh, that's interesting. Don't bring me into his failure. <laughs> you this? What? Uh, if you double click on the title bar of the character thing, it minimizes, and it stays open. The oh. character sheet? Yeah. Well, okay, no, just I having. If I go to the journal, click my name, double click that window, and it minimizes, it stays open. It doesn't disappear. Ah. He that's did interesting. He did 10 damage to you. So that's 3 points of damage. Okay. Which means you're down to 2 wounds. Yay. Alright, this dude's gonna move as well. It there. And then we're down to the last dude who's in the doorway. Who is scared out of his fucking mind. Wait. Guy in the doorway? Not door in the doorway, room? but the guy that you shot at from the doorway. Oh, okay. I was going to say, that he's asshole just shot does he get to yeah. shoot again? He's going to take a step back and then fire at you with his hand. Kind of shaky. He's, he's not happy right now. He's very he's not, not happy. happy right now. But he makes the shot, shaky hand and all. Uh. And you already wasted your dodge, right? Yeah. Okay. He's a wood thingy. You can't use a fate point to change this dude's thing. Oh. Eleven. Really? God damn it. Uh. And that was to the where. Oh, that was an eleven, so it was to an arm. Anyways, that's negated by how much? So how much damage is that in crit? Seven. Seven, so it's five crit damage. Five crit damage? You what? Had two wounds. It dealt, you dealt seven damage to you, correct? Four. Yeah. So that's four, four. points of damage that he did. Oh, okay. So I that's you meant two crits. I asked how much damage he did to you, and you were like seven. So oh. that's, no. That's why I was saying that. That's how much armor he has. Okay. Sure, why do you know remember this? Because it's your character sheet. I don't need to. 
Okay, so you got two crit damage to an arm, so... Let me go look that up. Now, how's he not dead yet? This is impact with damage. To the arm. And that was two. The strike leaves a deep bruise on your, I believe it's your left arm. You take one level of fatigue. Good. Alright. You're okay, Roger. Well, I'm not. It's For a minus now. 10 to all of my rolls. It's, yeah, when you're fatigued, it's a minus 10 to any roll you make. Uh. All right, Ben, your turn. Thank you for fucking this, Richard. <laughs> you, you know, this would have been simpler if you just jumped down the quarry and accepted your damage. No, well, <laughs> I would still be damaged. Maybe Minus. less, or you could have rolled a good agility and not taking any damage at all. Nope. Which, in my case, did not work out. Yeah, Ben, how did that work out for you? All right. You got damaged. Aim and shoot at this guy. Where is my car thing? Hunting rifle, 20? You're taking an aim shot? It's 30 yeah. if it's an aim shot. 30. Good. And you get to roll 2d10 plus your bonus. Oh. So roll one more d10 and we're just going to add it. Just an... 2d10 plus 3, sorry. Yours isn't correct. Roll 2d10. Plus two, three. Wait, what? Plus three. Eight. Wow. Those are two really bad d10s for you. <laughs> oh, okay. Alright, Stubbsy, your turn. Uh, I understand what happened. You dealt eight damage to the dude that's standing in the doorway. Oh, okay. And now it's Stubber's turn. How'd you get in the room? Why? So you can shoot me more? <laughs> Better <laughs> off, like, running into this room. Go for it. Ben! Kill them all! <laughs> you fair, that might be a good idea. Would be a good idea. Uh. All right, fine. I use my action to run here. Okay. Are you gonna close the door while you run through? Yes. Okay. So apparently, that's a thing. <laughs> <coughs> Doors. Oh, what the shit? Oh. Well, apparently I did that wrong, but it's not gonna matter because they're all gonna go in order. Anyways, the dude in the doorway is going to shoot at Dulles with an aimed shot, and that. Is that his last shot? No, it's not. And he misses anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Okay. And this muff right here, he's going, he's going back away. He's still fucking scared. <laughs> Did we figure out if reloading was a half action or something? Do you have... Uh, Depends on your weapon. And if you have reload. Do you have rapid reload or not? Uh, not I, think, I think I do. Maybe. Or no, it's quick reaction. Or rapid reaction. Really gonna need to memorize your character sheet more. Yeah, you, I don't, do. you don't have it. I know I don't have it. I don't have it. Mm. So yeah, it's a full action to reload your weapon. I'll just reload out here then. Okay. Stubsy, your turn. Um, being that there's not much I'm I can do, I'm gonna delay my turn. <coughs> okay. 
So you want to go before Dallas then? Sure. Or do you want to just wait until just before you go again, so you basically get double turn? Sure. All right. You can only delay half an action when I do that. I know. All right, so this dude's going to shoot at Dallas again with a aim shot. And he misses. Which one is this guy? Is this the top guy? Yeah, this is the top guy. Oh, no! The top guy moves to the doorway, but he can't shoot you, and you can't shoot him yet. And this dude is still fucking petrified, <laughs> and he moves in the corner. <laughs> corner is the safest place. All right, Dallas, your turn. Aim and shoot at that guy. Do with it. Plus 30. Plus 30. Modifier 30. So. Uh, just roll your damage. 1d10 plus 3. Ah! Actually, then roll the one. What does he get? No nothing. Nothing? What do you mean? get anything for a one. That was the damage roll, that wasn't his weapon skill roll. Oh. Okay. So he dealt four damage to that dude. And that's negated by good. Okay. Stubsy, what do you want to do? You have not one much. and a half actions. Yeah. Still not a whole lot I can do in this corner, though. Uh, If he moves here, can he shoot at... No. Right now, no one can shoot at Summer because he's behind a closed door. Yeah. Oh, right. They could try and blow the door away. That'd be about as close to the door. Hmm. Only if the tips touch. <laughs> There's not a whole lot I can do. Just chill, man. So I guess I will skip my turn. You're not even going to put yourself in a different position? You're just going to stand there? Yep. Not a whole lot I can do. Can't you apply a triage? Medicaid no, I don't Medicaid. have Medicaid. And I don't have anything to use for Medicaid. So, right. so this combat's going to get hella boring. Okay. <laughs> Guess it's what this guy's going to do? He's going to take a half-action aim at Dallas. And he misses. <laughs> Woo! These guys need better shooting skills. This guy's going to step out into the doorway. And they get a shot without a name that does. And he misses. Woo! <laughs> and this dude is fucking petrified, and he is just going to stay in the corner. Woo! Dallas, you're he ever, Is he ever going to calm down? I got four bullets left. I wish I could see the health on these two. I think this guy's at full. The guy that's furthest away from you is bleeding slightly from, I believe, his arm and... Uh, body and the guy closest to you is bleeding from I believe you gave him, gave him a body shot that hurt pretty bad I think that's only where he's bleeding from now right. I should probably try and finish off this guy then do, 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 do. aim and shoot I have three bullets after this yep. good 2d10 plus 3 Oh damn, dude. I know, right? I'm getting all these ones today. You really are. You're shooting oh, the wait. Guy? His first roll got a crit. The one that had auto rolls? Or rolls? Mm. Are you not counting those ones anymore? Or? Yeah, I haven't been counting those. I've just been like skipping that because it's not rolling right. 
Oh, yeah, because it's Cause six. Because he got a crit and he got six damage. Like, that makes no sense. Yeah, okay. Never so mind. So I'm just not counting that roll. That's why I'm making them roll all separately. Gotcha. Anyways, that really hurt the dude. Even though it really shouldn't have because it's only eight damage. So... Where did that hit? That hit in the body. And that's an impact weapon. Which means... A blow to this target's body steals the breath from his lungs. This target can only take a half action on his next turn. Good for him. Good for him. Roger? Uh, Delay? I don't know. Masturbate in the corner? Maybe. You can masturbate in the corner if you want. I'm doing up fighting. Do. I'll fight all of them. Not a whole lot I can do. Don't worry about it. Whip out your great sword and jab the stick dude in the stomach. <laughs> you break through the walls and this hit guy? the guy in the back. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> search I, I, search could, him? I could I could I could charge him. Search you him could. for stuff. I could charge him. Okay. Steals money. I don't have any use for that though. I kinda kinda okay. need this guy alive. So I'll just keep standing guard at the store then. Yep. All right. So this dude takes a half action to, uh... Break into this room and stand right here. Oh, motherfucker! <laughs> God! Damn it! And this how guy... Was, how was that a half action run? What are their agility? A, oh, wait. Oh, right, he has to take a half action. Sorry. Yeah. Then he's going to. No way in hell, unless he has sprint, but he. Re well, even the whisper. Even he, he can't can... do it because it's full action. I forgot it was yes. half. Yes. Uh, what's he going to do? So does he have any skills that will help him here at all? He's going to have an awareness test. <laughs> no, uh, uh. I guess he'll just take a shot at you. Ah, uh, miss. Missed. And this dude is finally kind of regaining his nerve a little bit. Deli, your turn. Aim shoot. Do it. I gotta stop closing my window. I also feel like I skipped the top guys around, but whatever. Miss. Ah, uh, no. Stubborn. Defense. Let me borrow your gun. Why would I let you take my gun? You don't know how to use it, do you? Do you know how to use last guns? Uh, I thought I did. If you know how to use a last gun, how come you're not using one? I don't have a last gun. I have a flaz pistol. Anyway, I guess I only have. What are you gonna do? I have last pistols. Uh. Uh, I don't know. I guess I'll occupy this square be with the door closed still. Okay, no problem. Alright, so now this enemy is going to run through and go here. Because he has a full action now. And this dude is going to take a half action aim at Dallas and completely whiff it. And this dude, who has finally gotten some nerve back, is going to tentatively walk forward. <laughs> Not even, like, three meters. All right, Dallas, your turn. So confident. Uh, I'm so tired of being all the way back here. I want to keep shooting at that guy. Shooting at that guy. da 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 da, -da. Aim shoot. Aim shoot. Aim shoot. Aim shoot. Uh, what's your range for it? For the hunting rifle? Yeah. 150. Okay. Then yeah, it's still plus 30. And I roll one. 1d10 plus 3? 2d10 plus 3. If you get more than 2 degrees of success, you roll 2d10. 2d10 plus 3. That's a shot. 
Another one. What the hell? At least you got a nine to balance it out. Eh, that's true, I guess. <sighs> All right, so let's see what happens to this guy. Oh, that's the right leg, I think. Um, yeah, so your your shot rips his leg apart, uh, causing blood to spray out in all directions. Even as he tries futilely to stop the sudden f uh, flood of vital fluid, he falls to the ground and, uh... Passes well, out? he dies in a spreading pool of gore. The agony is so incredible that his uh, screams drown out all conversation for uh, 2d10 meters for the rest of the round. It's pretty intense, actually. <laughs> for a hunting rifle? A little bit. <laughs> so for 11 meters, which I don't think anyone's in, so it doesn't nope. matter. Nope. All right, Stubbsy, your turn. Bum, bum, um, that guy dead? Yeah, yeah this one's the dead. in the back is dead. Alright, sorry. I need to mark that. <laughs> <Dead>. <laughs> oh, so we can loot, his, loot him later? Okay. Um, no, we just never use those, and I wanted to use them now. <laughs> okay. Dead. Um... Okay, I guess I'll open the door and briskly uh, walk here. That's it. Very good. Yep. So yeah, this this guy right here. That one? Or that one? Oh, that one. He's gonna briskly walk over here. That guy's dead. <laughs> and this guy feeling very confident. Moves here. Right there. Alright, Deli, your turn. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Take a full action to move. Keep in mind his screams are still ringing in your ears. <laughs> I don't okay. think I can hear him. I'm gonna run yeah. here. Okay. your action full action Stubbsy what are you doing did you say this door was broken no, no he closed it closed. he closed Both of the doors leading into those rooms are closed this door is open this door is open oh, yeah that door would be open because you opened it last right yeah so, you opened right it before open, the left one's closed. this one's closed okay. this one's open and the one in the very back right is also open well near the corpse near the door Actually, to be fair, all of the doors on the right side are open. And all of the doors except for the bottom one on the left side are closed. Hmm. Uh, this hotel's so big. Or in. It's so roomy, you guys. Oh so, my god. <laughs> you know, for shits and giggles, I'm going to sprint and run all the way over here. <laughs> god, you really right, want his loot, right don't here. you? I, I kind of do. Okay. I'm kind of curious. I haven't oh, been able to loot something before. Uh, I'm assuming that's probably a half action. Depends on how well you want to loot his body. <laughs> well, I want everything. Consider it cavitous, cavity that's search. That's going to be a uh, full action at least. Okay. Oh, he's got to look for evidence oh, too. Oh wait, I I can wait with while well, he's screaming. No, oh, he's wait. dead. He's, he's, still, like, he's, he's not dead. screaming anymore. He's dead now. Oh, okay. he, you still have ringing in your ears though from how loud it was. It's fine. I'll he wait. was dead at last turn. <laughs> I'll wait. I'll wait. Um. Yeah, this guy's gonna delay. That dude's dead. And, uh, this dude's gonna very tentatively move up to here. Deli, your turn. Alright. That door's open, right? Yeah. yeah. Alright, I'm gonna walk here. Okay. And blam, blam. Okay, you walk blam, there. Blam. And then you get to shoot with the plus ten. Plus ten? range, yeah. Nope. Ah. Okay. No go, Stubbsy. Um. Yeah, 
Let's uh cavity search this bastard. What does he what does he got? Alright. Well, how do you wanna go like describe to me how you're going through him? Oh the What? Describe, describe that? It, yeah. I I can't just like Ellie nor this stuff and like different open up. This stuff's a... gonna take different amounts of time. Like if you're gonna take all of his clothes off, it's gonna take more than a full action to get through all of the searching. What? Uh, oh, well, you said like two seconds ago. Um. Well. How about this? What if I just dedicate a full action to searching him? Could I continue searching him afterward? Yeah. That's just, okay. That's just let's full do that. This time. So what are you, like, how are you searching him? Are you taking his clothes off, or are you, like, feeling around his pockets and shit? Oh. If I'm using a full quiet. action, then let's, let's take off his clothing. Alright, he's now naked. Good. <laughs> <laughs> what I get? His clothes. His clothes. <laughs> well, what's in his nothing, clothing? Nothing in his clothing? You haven't searched it yet. What? <laughs> Mother! What's the point of taking off his clothing, man? Should have searched his pockets instead no of searching idea. his. I don't know his... why you did it. You just wanted a naked dude back there, apparently. Uh, Richard, please. I'm the best. <laughs> Looking for stuff. I'm wanting to loot his body. This dude's going to uh, delay again. This dude's dead. This dude's going to take a half action aim at Delhi. Which gives him an extra modifier, which is kind of nice because he's Delhi is now in close range to him. Doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> I missed. Delhi, your turn. Aim and shoot. Do it. Plus thirty. Boop, boop, boop. Plus thirty. Plus thirty. Plus five. Do 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 do. Plus thirty. Plus thirty. Hit 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 hit. Nope. Oh my god. Ugh. That was two uh, really bad rolls, because even the damage was a one. That really right, calculated. Your really turn. What do you want to do? Well, now that I have his clothing, <laughs> I would like to check said clothing. Right. Maybe he has some healing stuff. Uh, anything in his pockets. In his pants, you find uh, a knife attached to his belt. Okay. You pull the stub automatic from his hands. Um... You have his threadbare clothing, poor quality. Uh, you find two spare stub clips and three gelt. Good. There you go. Tucker was poor. That's what you found. Three gelt. Three gelt. I want three, three gelt. Three gelt, a gun, and two clips. And some clothing. And some really shitty bullet, blood-laden bullet hold in clothing. <laughs> Still screaming. Okay. Um, you take. Uh, do you want to take off the bottom part of his pants <laughs> on his blown off leg? I'm sorry, I didn't take off all of his clothing. I thought you said he was naked. He is oh, naked. He is his naked, leg over his, there isn't. His... <laughs> you mean his well, leg over? Be, is he wearing cargo? Uh, Dallas blew off his leg at the hip. In such a way that his his both both. Legs went off in one no, direction. Just no, one of them. What? One leg. One is leg still is still fully clothed, and the other leg is attached to him, which he took his pants off of. And the other leg has got how much He's clothing only got on two it? Leg, just like the mm. pants what? thing. The pants the leg that was attached to that leg. leg. The pants Richard, I don't leg. think you understand how explosions work. <laughs> it wasn't an explosion. It was impact damage. Oh, well, still. Uh, whatever. Which could he really have in one sleeve of his? pants <laughs> you could if you wear his pants you'll look like titus yeah. <laughs> um <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> and how much of my actions did i spend already well you have a complete free action right now like you haven't spent anything for this action oh okay uh well in that case i'm gonna drop off the shitty clothing okay um you fold it and put it nicely you over folded his package. it you folded, folded it, it. That's great. Ten Good job, Roger. Sense. Um, <laughs> bleach out the blood. Wait, how far can I? Yeah, move again. Eighteen. Um. Bu -bu 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 um. I don't think it really matters. So I guess I'll move here. Okay. Yeah. 
Sounds yep. like a pram. What is Roger on his hands right now? A sword? That My last gun? Oh, right Lowe's. now, what he has. Well, actually, right now he doesn't have anything in his hands, technically. Because he was just messing with shit. But I guess, yeah, <laughs> he probably re equipped his last gun. Uh, so, yeah, this dude's just gonna delay. This dude's dead. This dude's gonna take a half action aim at Dellis. Richard. And fucking nailed that roll! Mm -hmm. Can you feel it? Then you should probably try to dodge that. I guess. You're really gonna have to start declaring this faster. I'm just gonna start rolling damage. And then you can't dodge. Modifier, zero. Good. Oh, Ben was like, nope, I'll take it. No. Nope. I'll take it. Oops. Oh my god. And that hit you in the arm. So how much armor do you have? Five, but it's it's primitive. Primitive. It's a standard solid projectile, so you get half I think, because this isn't primitive. It's not wait. Uh yeah, not primitive. Yeah, okay, so it's five, so you have three armor. How much toughness do you have? Uh god damn it. Why do I keep closing this window? I have no idea. Toughness is like thirty seven, I think. So three. Nope. Thirty four. But yeah, so three. three. Okay, so that did six damage to you, you now have two wounds left. Oh no. Roger. Alright, right, Dallas, it's your turn. I have more damage than you do. Stop whining. <laughs> All right. Quit making me fucking murder this dude. <laughs> I am I'm eight, trying. I'm I eight am, points away from death. I am trying to murder this guy, and he won't let me. If it sh if they shoot you in the head, you're actually only three points away from death because anything on a five plus to the head kills you. Joy. Plus thirty, shoot at that guy. Do it. Do it. Hit. Hit. Yes. Two D ten plus three. Otherwise, you would have done physically impossible damage. You would have rolled a d10 and gotten a zero somehow. Yeah. 20! So that dude's yeah. fucking gone! <laughs> no kidding. And where did you hit him? You he pissed me him. off. You hit him in the arm. That so that guy's arm is gone. Fucking amazing. So he's gonna be squirting... No, I'm sorry. He's gonna be painting that room. <laughs> uh... In a rain of blood, gore, and meat, the target's left arm is removed from his body, screaming incoherently as he twists about in agony for a few seconds before collapsing to the ground and dying. The 10 plus. Um, the arm is removed and smashed apart by the force of this attack. The bone, clothing, and armor fragments fly about like shrapnel. Anyone within 2 meters of this target takes 1d10 minus 8 impact damage. We're good. Yeah, we're good. Unless Garvel is actually right here. No, he's not. It wouldn't matter because it's not close enough anyways. Mm. Anyways. Da, 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Roger, go switch that body. Alright, Stubbsy, your turn. <laughs> what, you want me to do that again? <laughs> if you uh, want. That other guy naked. So I'm then I take really... this dude's pants I mean, Unless off. you want to go fight the guy in <laughs> the left room. And I'm not really into that, but, I mean, okay. Um, I just sprinted here. Mm -hmm. Uh, so I guess I'll use a... Well, wait, this is the second one considered a half action or a full action? Full action. It's a full action move. Really? For six meters? Half ahead. action, full action, charge, and run. But if you sprint, you double your run. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, whatever. We'll loot him afterward. I'm gonna just move here. Okay. So this dude's gonna delay again. Deli, what are you doing? I am gonna move here. Okay. Do not open the door. And, 
Reloading takes a I'm gonna a reach flash. really uh, far and open. <laughs> Three meters to open nah, I guess I'll just chill there for now. And I'm gonna reload. Stubzy's gonna reload. I don't. What? How would I like, reload? What are you doing? No, no, he was asking if I was gonna reload, but oh, yeah, okay. I need a full action to reload, don't he I? Does. Yeah. I you only can, half you can start a reload now. It just takes a half an action on your next turn. Uh Then you should do that. All right, fine. I reload. Yeah. All right, Stubzy, what are you gonna do? Um. Well, the door is closed. Yep. Uh huh. Wait, am I able to open the door from here? It looks like uh, you sh maybe. Um, since it's three meters, if you want to use a half action, I'll let you do it. Really? And a charge is a full action? Yes. Yeah, but it was worth a try. Um, the interest of not fucking Dillis over, I'll delay my turn. <laughs> Very uh, good. So, opening a store would be a half action? Unless you're right up next to it, sure. Unless you're next to it, yeah. But I'm not next to it. It doesn't matter, it's not your turn right now anyways. Aww. It's the dude inside the building, or the inside the room's turn at the moment. The asshole alive. Is he freaking the fuck out? He doesn't know anything on the other side of the door. He knows nothing. Does he know that his other dude is dead? Nope. No? Well, he might have an idea that bad shit is happening on the other side of the door from all the screaming. <laughs> Otherwise, he knows nothing. Wait, what's your buddy doing? In a fit of fucking madness, this man bursts from the door and runs here. What? I'm sorry. He was able to run out of the door? Yes, he's not charging. I really don't understand that rule. Okay, what do you, okay, the way that it works, since he delayed last turn, is he moved a half action to be next right. to the door, open it, and then run. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Is that he in the room, sense. or is he outside here? He's outside of the room. All He's right. in the hallway right now. He's in the hallway, rad. So we can shoot him. You can. Yeah. And I won't incur any kind of penalty from... Shooting him gets Dallas is here, right? No, because Dallas isn't really in melee, and I'm just gonna assume that you're like, because it's three meters. Like she's not three meters wide. Okay. <laughs> I would, I I would hope, hope not. not. Anyways, are you three <laughs> meters wide? Dallas, no. are you nine feet fucking wide, bitch? Dallas, you heavy? You, you what, heavy? Don't I? You okay? I have a slender build. Anyways, it's Dallas's turn. Aim and shoot at this <laughs> Okay, go for it. Well, wait. Oh, never mind. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Okay. Yeah. Plus 30. Yep. Hit, hit, hit. Alright, so yeah. you plus 3. God Ooh, damn it. What's if all these Roll ones? Ballistic. Oh, oh my tennis. Tennis. Ben, that 10 is good, though. Yeah, I know, but skill again. I keep rolling I don't care, Brian, just fucking rolling no, skill. Okay. Modifier? None. None. Ugh. Okay, so you did 14 damage to him. Well, it was a valiant effort, but unfortunately for this poor, poor gentleman who was shot in the fucking leg... <laughs> who looked down the aisle and saw his friend and knew in the moment that that shell hit his leg that he would befall the same fate. His leg <laughs> flies off and he screams maddeningly loud. Door okay. splashing everywhere and he dies. So I have a thing for shooting legs, huh? Guess so. And in in 12 meters, everyone's deafened, but barely doesn't reach Dallas. 
And, uh, yeah, now, uh, now everybody's dead. Then you should loot the corpses. Okay, I'll go... Wait, I already used the full action. It's after combat, you don't have to. Okay, I'll go loot this... Everything's the... free actions now. Yep. I'll go loot this corpse. I'll go check his pocket pants. And, and you his... can, can loot everything. I'll loot the... everything. You could do a cavity search on the, the top one. I, I no. think you might do that. You, you might... He might have a concealed cavity. Ugh. Then... All right, Can I make so, it so it doesn't look like a butt? <laughs> what? No. Anyways. He uh, could have concealed cavity. I didn't say he did. Overall, everything you get is two knives, two stub automatic revolvers, four clips, and what was that? Seven gelt. Seven gelts. There you go, bud. And you two sets that. of really shitty blood-soaked clothing. Who gets the seven gelts? You do. You looted the bodies. You that's why I made yeah, you do it. That's why I got it. But you can give it to the other person. You don't have to keep it. So now I have 507 gelt. When do I get monthly monies? When the month When a month passes. Oh. Yep. Which I believe for them is in like two weeks. No idea. It's, oh no, it's only a week away now for you guys because it's like, I think it's... 11 days. Uh -huh. it, was, it was two weeks to get here. And then it's been five days. So, yeah, it's in like 11 days. So, what are you guys gonna do now that it's, uh, like midnight? You're back in your inn. There's fucking blood and gore fucking everywhere. Just pass out. Um. Well, I'm heavily bleeding. So, that's fun. Like, I am, am I critically wounded, technically? Yes, you have two critical damage. You are critically wounded. It takes an entire week without medical treatment to clear it off. If you get Medicaid, if you get medical assistance, you can take off the uh, doctor's intelligence bonus per week. Mm. Critical damage. Fun. But it costs you money, and he has to pass a test. He doesn't, like, mutilate my body if he fails, does he? Or that was only with Medicaid. Uh, that's first aid. In extended care, it doesn't affect you as much, I don't think. But I'll oh. look over it. Anyways, you're not going to be able to do that tonight. I could, but then I'd piss off the doctor even more since I... Like, the last time I bugged him was around this time at night. Yeah. I don't think he likes me for that. Um... Anyways, I'm pretty sure we only have... We have sub-10 minutes, so whatever we're going to do, do it fast. Oh, well, if we only have ten minutes, then maybe we should just cut it off here and do end game. Yeah, but I mean, do you guys want? Are you guys gonna go to bed? Or are you gonna try and get the doctor? Or just give me a last action. Oh, then I'm gonna. Can I, I guess... recover? Huh? You do what? Can I recover wounds from just sleeping, or do I gotta see a doctor? You, you would have to see a doctor. passively recover wounds. Yes. All right. You don't have to see a doctor to recover wounds. How many wounds is he at, though? Two, because like, he's well past. Yeah, he's his... heavily damaged, which means that you recover. You recover the. Uh, if you're resting, you recover your toughness bonus and wounds a week. If you're moving around, you recover one a week. And uh, if you get medical attention, you recover the intelligence bonus of your physician a week. Mm. <laughs> um. But I'll look over Medicaid just to make sure about that for you. Okay. Guys. Well. Um. I guess as a last action, since I didn't actually check the body, I go into Nihilus's room and see if um. My little puppet is alive. Uh. Yes. Your. Your friend's body is in fact alive. Hmm. That's good. It appears that uh, they did not damage him at all. But the, the room does look like it's been ransacked. Oh, crap. Um, can I check to see if the Inquisitor's seal is still here? Or do I have to do a perception? Uh, you have to search for it. Unless you just want to know if it's where he left it. I know it's... Because um, you do know where he left it if you want to just look there. But if you want to, like, search the room for it, then you have to search. 
Okay, fine. Then I'll do the first one. I'll check where I know where it was. Uh, you look on the in the dresser drawer uh, where he left it, in his like tucked in his clothing and stuff, and you do not find the ring. I damn it. Well then, freaking Danny, <laughs> why you do this? It's the best, huh? God. Uh, um. Oh, fuck it. Why not? 17% chance, and I don't find shit. Good. Good. So, for critical damage, if you get a doctor's success, he takes away two a week, plus an extra one for each degree of success. If he <coughs> fails, you're not adversely damaged, and you remove damage at a normal rate. If he fails by three degrees or, or more, uh... You take one damage if you're lightly or heavily wounded, or die if you are critically wounded. I'm sorry, I can die? Yep. It says use sudden death to resolve critical damage if he fails by three or more degrees. Oh, God. <clears throat> Failing by five or more degrees indicates that all patients take one d10 damage. Again, use sudden death to resolve critical damage. Hmm. Good. And I'm critically wounded, so let me remove one point of critical damage for each week of rest. Actually, I don't remember if critical damage can be removed by just resting. That's what this says. It does? <coughs> yeah. Okay. With medical attention. Oh, well, I'm sorry. It says uh, with medical attention, doesn't it? You do not recover without medical. Okay, fine. So you need to do it. Well, I mean, uh, really, worst case scenario <laughs> is he fucks up and you have to burn a fate point, which would suck, but you wouldn't die. Okay. We're running out of those. <laughs> Alright, Grim Darkness. I haven't used any yet. This is Fuck your first you. game. <laughs> this is your first game and you almost got to critical. You'll get there, to, don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah, ben, my, my first combat session, I had to use a fate point. I died. That's great. Anyways, so what do you guys... Uh, oh, so yeah, you look all over the room. You scour the entire room. And you don't find his ring. Uh, you, As you walk out of the room, you see the uh, innkeeper dragging the corpses out <laughs> and his wife mopping up after it. They look at you but don't say anything. Uh, so they... Okay. Um... They look kind of just scared, and they're just trying to, like, Piece do something so their daughter doesn't come up and see a bunch of corpses. Oh, right. Um, Sorry, little girl. He had to die. <clears throat> um, well, this is awkward. Uh, okay. If you want to roleplay this, we'll do it when we come back, because we don't have the time. Oh, I killed all yeah, of them. Uh, let's do that. All right. Then it's time for the end game stuff. Yay! Yeah. Except for the mantic yeah. bar. What? That's just too pulling over there. Leave him alone. Alright. Are you playing Diablo Tree? Sure. Um. Alright, so that was six hours basically. Yep. So I'm gonna give you guys. Mmm. You know, what? I'm gonna give you guys 500 XP for that. Yeah, oh, that was a very yeah. hard session for you. <coughs> cool, take it. And because I'm feeling magnanimous, and because I just kind of want to fuck over Danny a little bit more, <laughs> if you would like, uh, Roger, you can either split this up or put all of it on your other character as well. The 500. Yeah. Oh. You can do 300 here and 200 there, or you can do... No, uh, just keep it all in stubber. Here. Okay. <coughs> um, you guys don't have any bonds with each other, so that's irrelevant. Did you guys create a new alter ego contract or, or contact or confidant? Contact. Um... Greg, Hornax, uh, the, uh, um... Not really. 
These tech priests aren't friendly. None yeah. of them want to talk to me. Um, um having said that though, I, I we didn't have Krieg as a confidant before. Or well he's still not a confidant. He'd be a contact if you guys didn't get it from that. I don't think you gave it that to us last time. I could be wrong though. <laughs> I'll look over it, and I'll tell you guys tonight if you guys get the extra 50. Mm. Pass that now. Okay. Did you discover any important clues? Uh, The melt bomb thingy? Yeah, the melt canister thing. It's kind of interesting. We didn't know that part of it before. Um... Um... <coughs> useful though I'm going to speed this along yes you guys did look at uh, all this stuff that points at the Herontis that you found that was <laughs> all very useful information yeah okay Guess whether I mean, it's completely accurate or not is irrelevant it gives you a place to go oh uh, okay basically important clues mean you have an avenue that you really need to pursue now oh uh, so even if it ends up being yeah, like you're just feeding me stuff? You're not going to know stuff until the very end if it was actually that important or not. Uh, but it's more like if you put stuff that's like, okay, we really need to focus on like the Herontis now. Because a lot of people are saying this. Oh, alright. Then that's yeah, The Herontis are the enemies. And did you eliminate any threat to the Imperium? Those guys uh, in the um, room? No, that, not an immediate threat. Um... Does the Carnosaur count? It does. Oh, then yes, I killed the Carnosaur. Because it was a threat to the tech priest's building stuff. Then yes. was an indirect, but still a threat to the Imperium. Alright, so you guys get 500 experience for this session, and I'll let you guys know if you get another 50 for the contact. Okay. Of the creek. Do I do we get anything extra for killing the Carnosaur? Uh, no, you got the 1,000 guilt. I, damn it. <laughs> Mother, give that away, Cardarvit. That would have bought an eviscerator. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that's over, Dark Horse. Time to end the stream. Yeah.